We are here for episode number 15 of Go Berg or Go Home. Joining me today, we have members of the men's soccer team. We've got Ben, Sigurd, and Jared. Gentlemen, how are we? Doing well. How are you? Doing well. You guys ready to go? Yes, sir. Yeah. Excellent. As you know, we're going to ask you four questions. Question number one is a multiple choice question. Heidelberg won its first ever OAC tournament with a win in 2014. It was a 5-4 victory on the road. Who did we beat that game to win the OAC tournament? Was it A, John Carroll, B, Ohio Northern, C, Capital, or D, Mount Union? Guys, it's A. I'm telling you right now. I don't even know what to say. It. I, have, I have no clue. So. And it's John yeah, Carroll. I, yeah, I would trust. I trust Travi on that. You want to lock it in on A? Lexi had the game winner, I believe. That is the correct answer. It is John Carroll. It was a, uh, a terrible weather night. It rained the entire time. It was cold. It was miserable. We were up 5-1 with about 20 minutes left to play and held on for dear life to pick up the win. So we are one for one. Congratulations. Let's move on to question number two. This is the would you rather round. I asked Coach Savilic, the father of, a, of an infant, I said, would you rather have to never, ever change another diaper or never, ever have to wake up in the middle of the night to, uh, to, uh, with a crying baby? Do you think you would rather have to never change a diaper or never have to wake up for a crying baby? Ooh, geez. I don't know. I mean, he does he does enjoy the whole breakfast club thing, though. Yeah, I, I don't think he like minds. Five a.m. practices. Up. I don't think he yeah. minds waking up. I don't think he does that either. So I'd say our I say it's the never changing diapers ever again. Is that yeah. you guys agree? Yeah, I, I agree with yeah. that one. I agree. Good. Lock it in. Yes. Sir. yes. Yep. Not correct. Ooh. He said he would rather Ooh. never. No, he's not. He's not. No, 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 no. He's lying. In fact, he's lying. <laughs> in fact, you know, where all the other coaches did have like a long explanation, his was just in all caps, sleep. He would prefer to have the sleep. So we're one for two. He's That's lying. okay. <laughs> yeah. That's okay. We're moving on to question three, which is the guess who round. Um, I had my children, my seven year old daughter, my 10 year old son. They each drew a picture of one of your teammates' headshots. You have to guess which teammate they drew. And again, it's the same person that they drew. There is the there are the pictures. <laughs> Who is that? Now I will tell you also, it is not any of you three. Hmm. I think that might be uh has a goatee. That might be Corey Gilbert. Like that yeah, be... uh, yeah. I was about to say Corey because because there's not a lot of people who has like yeah. that kind of a beard on the team. Yeah. I like that. I like who that. else is it? It's. Um, who else got facial hair? I thought John, but like the picture on the right looks like like Corey's like yeah. kind of long like hair. hair. Yeah. 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 And also, if you look at the hair, like it's some more curly than straight. I think that's just a little kid drawing, Sigurd, but maybe. maybe. No, well, like, yeah, well, like, if it, all right, fine, look at the right one, then. It's it's more <laughs> curly than straight. And he shaded in the face. That could mean something. Yes. I would, yeah. I, don't I, like, know. I like the Corey. I don't know who else has. Tell him, Corey, tell him Simon Corey. don't have the facial hair down here. Yeah. Yeah, I, yeah, no, he doesn't. At least not, like, as nearly as much as Corey does, so. Mm-hmm. Mr. Gilbert. I, yeah, I, I agree with that one. All right. Lock it in on Corey Gilbert. Yeah. Yes, sir. You are correct. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> it is Corey Gilbert. I do apologize to Corey for the elf like ears that my daughter drew. <laughs> but, uh, it's it's, it's kind of accurate, though. The <laughs> the picture. So we are two for three, and we are headed into the 20 second challenge. Oh, As shit. you guys know, I'm going to give you a question with nine possible answers. You have to give me seven answers in 20 seconds, which does go by very quickly. So I will, I will warn you on that. 
the question, the time will start after I read, finish reading the question. Are you guys ready? Mm -hmm. Okay. Going back to the 2019 season, so last year, oh, no. nine players started at least 10 matches. Can you name seven of the players, of the nine players who started at least All 10 right. matches last year? Go. Ryan Newman. Ryan Newman. John, John Gall. Gall. Spencer, Spencer Treadwell. Jared Chavez. Kyle Martin. Spencer Treadwell. Kyle Corey Gilbert. Gilbert. Corey Gilbert. Um, Simon. Simon Joseph. Did I start 10 games? Is that many games? I don't yeah. know. Sigurd yeah. 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 Sigurd. Sigurd. Jared. I don't know if you finished with right. 10. Time up. Time is up. I think I heard six, but we'll see. You said Ryan Newman, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. John Gall. Mm -hmm. Spencer Treadwell. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Kyle Morton. Yeah. Jared Chavez. Yeah. Sigurd. Yeah. Did you guys say Sam Federici? Federici? No. Yeah. You say Boy, Bryce, we gotta lie a little bit. Come on, what? Did anybody, say Did anybody say Bryce? Did anybody say Kelly? I didn't know he started ten games. I, yeah. I thought about him, but yeah, it's again. So I there you go. So those are the three. So then you guys got six out of the ten. So we do not qualify that as a correct answer. So I bring things up. You guys finished two for four. Not terrible, yeah. not great. Yeah. Any worse? Trust me, we saw a lot worse this year on these, on these games. So, right now, let's go through the scoreboard. Atop the scoreboard with four out of four, the football offensive players, women's lacrosse, men's basketball. At three wins, there are three right correct answers, women's basketball, wrestling, the defensive guys from football, with two cheerleading, baseball, uh, cross-country track and field, and men's soccer. One correct answer for women's soccer, men's lacrosse, and women's golf. And zero correct answers for softball. So you guys are middle of the pack, very respectable, and I think very close to getting a, a much better score. But gentlemen, thank you so much for being part of Go thank Bird you. or Go Home. Thank you. Thank you very thank much. You guys doing this.